What's up guys and welcome back, we're here with another episode of our Lord of the Rings Realms in Exile campaign. It, thank you very much for the support of the last one, I didn't plan to make this uh, too much of a serious campaign, but you know, I might make it a quick, a nice quick one. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for the likes and subscribes and just all the comments uh, on it as well. And keep it up, keep putting them in and uh, we'll keep seeing more episodes on this. But anyway, going on with the episode. The plan is, we've got a claim on these elvish people, um, but they've got like a lot of negatives if we go to war with them till I think it's uh, 1322, so we've got quite a while, we've got about 7 years to wait. Um, so I think I'm going to go to war with either Cardlan or with Rudar, one or the other, but we are going to try and go to war with these guys. Um, Lindon, oh not Lindon, Lorien here. We will uh, take your money and your food. See, I, I've already done this like on my own just to see for fun what would happen. Um, and Arthurdain always cowards out and doesn't join the war. So I don't really want to go to war with them just yet. Available to suggest the old lions of the dead. We know it's a sad thing to see, but it happens. Anyway, we're building up a military. Um, a fairly good one. I think our, we've got like nearly 150 cohorts. Yeah, 147. We're doing very well. I don't need this stupid decision here. Get away. I'd like support for my air. Uh, yep, yeah, legitimacy. Support for the air, please. Um, and that should do. Scorn families. We have a lot of them. Rudar, if we went to war with you. Oh, okay. Okay, king. The son of the king of Cardland's arrived. I could make him a foreign I could make him a citizen yeah why not make him a citizen <laughs> take him from me uh, take him from him um, can I force Rudar to break an alliance because I'd like that oh no I don't want to declare war on them though but yeah only our, everyone would join still offer alliance I'll say off mm, I'll take the alliance for now, Rudar. I'll take the alliance because I'd like to see if you would backstab Cardland with me. But apparently not. Uh, let's improve relations. I'm not sure if that's good or bad, to be honest. Um, but we've we've got a we've got a thing. Um, we'll have tax again because we need the money. You can always do with more money, Lorian. I'd like to improve my relations with you. We can offer something at least. Commanders like bribes, don't they? We don't need their support. Uh, yeah, just go with that. Go with that one. I don't really want to bribe anyone. It's not really what I want to do. Um, We have all these uh, allies down here, but none of them will join me in a war. Dol Amroth would. Because they're good, loyal men. Um, He's gained content. Okay. What was it? Oh, not good. It's a health thing. Oh, blimey! How old is my guy? 190. He's not. He's surely not long for this world. Next one's 122. Arrange a marriage, though. Let's get married to. Yeah, her. She seems good. An interracial marriage? Oh gosh. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Um, but. He's got, let's just arrange an interracial marriage. Yeah, sure. Go on, let's do it for the... F do it for a joke. Let's see what happens. Fertility. Um, yeah, have her. Yes, keep giving me trade. There you go. He's wanting to buy a, buy a holding. Okay, and he's 61. He's old. He's young in comparison to, like, everyone else. Um, I just want you... See, they wouldn't have an alliance now, probably because we've got claims on them. I want them to break alliances, but you can't do it in this game, I don't think. No, I don't think you can. That's annoying. So all I want them to do is just betray Cardlin. Like, I mean... It's right in the middle. It's the perfect one for all of us to like expand into, and then I can take you out one by one as well. Um, 
Yeah, that's we're grateful. We'll build it. Who's? Oh, we've had another kid. Excellent. That's what we needed. Just more. Oh, she's a daughter anyway. It doesn't really matter. Arrange marriage. Marry him. Why not? Um. Yeah. There we go. Marry it. Marry them off. We'll do some. Do some realm maintenance while we're waiting. I guess I don't care about that. Um. I want support for the air. Demand. I want your support. I'm not also caring about whether you're well or not. You can die for all I care. If you're not going to support my heir. Um, I could write... I might raise this army up to... A thousand. I'll build three heavy infantry. They can arrive and do their thing. I don't know what our maximum is. It is 49,000 apparently is our maximum. Well. I'm not so sure about that. That might, be, that might be a lie. Um, but we will see. I'm going to... I don't know. I, I want to go to war with these elves. But, like, it'll anger everyone. Like, so much. If I just do it. So, we may have to just... It just seems to have to wait. There's a lot of waiting going on. If I want to war with Mordor... If I kill Mordor, I could do that, I guess. No one wouldn't mind if I did that. Yeah, actually, no one would mind if I did that. I will just fabricate a claim on you. Fine, we'll do that. I'll take some lands from you, Mordor. I'm not quite sure what lands I'm going to take. Undin, it said? Oh, here, yeah. Take this bit of land. Okay, yeah, I could do that. I might just carry on expanding as well. Just take all of Mordor out. Then we can deny, uh, we can deny, uh, Sauron, that's it. Why can I remember his name? I'm having struggling with names today. We could deny Sauron his stronghold in the east, and then, I don't know, we can then go and deal with Cardinal, because hopefully they've, stupidly, then they would have done stuff. Oh, they're at war with someone. Who are they at war with? Who are they at war? Actually, go back on that. Where the heck was that? All the way up here. Is it because you're at war with them? It is. You're wanting to go to war. I'm guessing these are the dwarves. Yeah, these are the dwarves. You're killing the dwarves with the blue mountains off. How could you, Lindon? Also, why aren't your armies going, like, west? Like, across this narrow sea. That's, the, well, not the narrow sea. That's Game of Thrones. Well done, Pope. Why aren't they going west to the Undying Lands? There we go. That's the one. Um, who knows? I'm going to build some mines, uh, I think. They call it a mine. But we're not dwarves, so... Um, and let's build some farms. There we go. Spend all our money. No, go away, Cardin. I don't want an alliance with you. Um... Yeah, I'll just take say he's doing a fine job. I'd rather not make him lose any more loyalty. He's not too loyal at the moment. Um, oh, now Arthur Dane's on their side. Oh, for God's sake. I do apologise, but I mean, this is getting infuriating now. This is why I don't think this is going to be too much of a long uh, series, because it's quite hard to expand. Uh, and I want to take out... I'd like to take out Mordor, and I'd like to take out like the other men... Um, factions because um, I want to form Arnold. That's the one. I'm trying to think what what I was trying to do. I want to form Arnold, and to do that, let's have a look again at what we need to do. Decisions. Oh, it's annoying that they've changed all the things, so I can't see. Form Arnold. I need all of those green territories that you can see here. This one's very close. I could take this possibly, um, but these are the ones. You know, they're going to take a little bit of time. I could probably actually take most of the Cardinal ones in one go. I could, there's an Arthur Dane. Arthur Dane is going to be a problem. Rudar's only got one. It's probably my next go-to like, go thing. Um, we'll see. But, I mean, it looks like we're going to have a war with Mordor before we're going to have a war with anyone else. Um, yeah, I'll pay that. Stability has increased yet. Yeah, it'll go down now to level out. Why, why was it, uh, I don't get why it's going to go down this much. Is it just because I've not got a claim yet? Yeah, I presume so. How far is the claim off being done? It's 89%. Okay, so we're nearly done. 
I might start getting this army into position then. Where's that? Um, let's send some of these armies back then. Let's send this thousand army back. And then let's send this thousand army back. That'll do. I would have thought. And then I've got the 8,000 huge stack here ready to go as well. Yep, okay, so we've got the claim on Mordor. Perfect. And now they have. I have no negatives from doing it, and lots of people seem like they'll join in this war. And a lot of people to support, please, for the air. You silly man. Thinking you get away with it. Um. What's the um, attrition like over here? It's pretty good. My supply limit is not great. I need to get... Is, what tech is there going? None. You're all about to go at level up, though. Hopefully. Um, construct city buildings. Oh, okay, this is a thing. I didn't realize. Um, oh, gosh. Um, this. It's so long since I played Imperator. I, so, I might build an academy. Let's build an academy here. And in Minas... Actually, in Minas Tirith, please. That was where I wanted to build it, but we'll have two. Why not? Um, let's build some marketplaces. Build one there. Excellent. Right, so we've got tech now. Um, let's do siege ability. There we go. Perfect. Right. I feel like that cost money. That just cost money, didn't it? Yeah. It's not actually costing like other things. It's just costing me money. Which, I mean, that's fine. I'm making a lot of money. Um, what's this? It's requesting that you bring the wrath upon Rudar if we break our lands. If I'm just gonna decline that. I don't know what. The yeah, Adain, not interested this time. Um, okay, so are we still in alliance with them? Yes, we are. So I don't get why that's really a thing. I'm not really. Not really understood what that is. I don't really care about it. I'll lose a bit of popularity. I'd rather go to war with Mordor right now. Because you're all being very unreliable in that part of the world. Anyway, war with Und for Undin. Pause. I'm going to call in all my allies. Call to arms. Yes, I don't care if you don't want to do it. Um, is that it? Are they the only people? I want to call Rudar in. Here we go. Call to arms. Access. I, I'll give you military access in a minute if you want it. Um, go and take Undin, and you go in there and take that. Right. They can't come through this way. They can take Sirith on goal, but I'm not really too fussed about that. And then we're going to take Undin. Oh, wow. It's just gonna. We're just going to take Undin just because of the fort being there. That's perfectly fine, then. Carry on. Uh, how many troops does... They have 84. Yeah, they've got nowhere near enough. Um, I'm just going to offer... Rudar military access. Um, there you go. Have military access, and you have military access. Perfect. Now you can come and help. I mean, you've probably still got to go through Cardlan, but that's only a real punishment would deter embezzlers. Um, yeah, we'll do that. Deter embezzlers, please. I don't really want the master of the guard. Yep, yeah, you can be master of the guard and. Heavy infantry discipline, please. Oh, we can get the other one as well. Well, we'll do it. Because that leaves us still with plenty of money to do other things. Right, so you do that. Carry on there. You're taking attrition. Oh, that was a, that was a battle. Oh, they just got raised up. Oh, and they're getting trashed at the Mordor armies. Wow. Just... I don't even see where these armies are appearing from. They're just like... They are literally appearing out of nowhere, and I'm just taking them. Okay, apparently I don't take this land. I'm just burning it. <laughs> don't know if I really want to do that. Yeah, we're beating these guys like really easily. Um, I might send this army through to go on to Barad-dur. Go on to Barad-dur, please. Because these armies are getting a bit worn out now. Um, blessings of wealth, please. Are you going to re replenish at any point? Like, come on armies, do something. Here we go, anyway. 
So let's get Barado and then we can probably call it a day there, I would imagine, on that. Uh, what have we got here then? Build cost, couple import routes. I'll take build cost, I think, to start with. Um, here comes Dol Amroth at least, so we're going to have one of our allies appear. I actually haven't given them military access. I like how I'm just destroying Mordor though. These guys have just got terrible armies. There we go. We can take that bit of land apparently. Oh no. Apparently we'd have to colonize it all again. Oh, I don't really want to do that. To be honest, I'd rather just just burn burn Mordor to the ground. It's more it's more suitable. It doesn't deserve anything better. Um I think this is their capital. If we take that, then that's pretty good. We'll do that. High priest, yep, yeah, sure. Popularity. And all that shenanigans. Where are you going? Where are they going? Yeah, these armies aren't replenishing, so I might send them back. Um to to wherever. Um send them back to Pelennor and to Minas Tirith. I'd rather not lose the armies, but I mean I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, here we go. This is a battle that we can't win, apparently. By all means, um, don't have actually the money to lose, so I'm going to just take the... Yeah, this is definitely a battle we can't win. This is a huge battle. This is probably this, the death of this army. Um, send this army back, please. Yeah, this is just zero. <laughs> this is... don't even know who this is. He's just a general. Oh, he's definitely going to die. Unless he just... Yeah, there we go. He's dead, and he's been captured. Oh well, we'll try and re get him out, but I mean it's it's a big ask. <laughs> um, just this is taking a long time. I mean, it's not that hard to siege stuff down. Um, theater, uh, we could do fortress training camp. I don't really know what a well, training camp we could do. I guess I'll put one in this city over here. These cities. Oh, there we go. There's some training camps for you guys. Enjoy them. Um, they're not going to take service from goal in time. Uh, there we go. We took Barador. What would... And that's just... They just all appear out of nowhere. Um, what could we get? Could we take Undin? Yes, we could. I couldn't take anything else, though. Actually, could I not get that? I occupied that as well. Oh, I could. I could take... I could take that. Well, um, and then could I release anyone? No, they wouldn't do anything like that. They wouldn't cede any territories. I might just take this for now, and I'd like a lot of money. Uh, don't think I can ask for money. No, it would seem not. No, I can't. I can just ask for. That's so stupid. Anyway, I'll take it. I guess. Um, the second army go back to here. Well, actually, no, the first army go back to here. The second army can just can also go back. Whatever. The second army can go there as well. Well, that's fine. They can cancel our military access. I don't even care. Um, yeah, they're going. Can we ransom this prisoner though? Um, we don't have that much money. How much would it take? Nine, uh, about 900. Well, I don't know if I really want to spend that much. Also, I've raised like half of Mordor's lands to the ground. barador has gone as well. That's no longer... <laughs> oh, God. I... What is this? I just... Um, can I do some migration then? Let's... Which one is it? Aqueduct? I... Actually, no. I don't want to do that. I want to do construct that. I don't want to do... Let's do this then. There. See if that improves migration. Uh, second army, just go and sit here. But now, um, I've lost a army, so I might just build some more troops. Um, over here, wasn't it? Was where? Uh, I don't know. Where was it? That? Here we go. Uh, do five heavy infantry. Do three archers. No, there we go. Just do that. That's fine. Do archers and then have some light infantry here. Um, yeah, that's fine. That can do. Perfect, right. Um, armies. Mm, uh, yeah. Oh, Athelian's lost its. Oh, no, I don't want that. Athelian's lost its governor. Well, it's 
it's all sorted now. <laughs> it's got its governor back. I'll go and get a pris that prisoner in a minute when I have about a thousand squids. No, I don't want to break... Oh, Arthurdane might break this alliance. Um, well, okay then, I'll break the alliance with Rudar. Dissolve this alliance, please. Thank you, there we go. Arthurdane now look like they'll... I just don't think Arthurdane wants me having an alliance with Rudar. Don't know, it's broken a bit. Um, I'll just side with this guy. This king's not been as strong in uh, keeping his um, governors on side. I'm going to put it like that. He's been a bit awful. Um, anyway, just general. Have him in charge. We'll get that other guy back soon. 13's pretty damn good, though. Oh, we've got lots of stuff now. Mid aggressive expansion. Well, I don't think really anyone cares about me expanding into Mordor. Um, capital import routes. Yeah, I couldn't also care really about getting that guy back. I said I would, but... I've changed my mind. You can go do one. Uh, wood. Um, I could import wood. Gives me more taxes. Um, from who? From who though? I'll get it from Andrast. I don't really want to import it from somewhere else and take it for my supplies. Um, anyway, this third army can go and sit in it's there. I get another one on the border of Cardlan, why not? Um, so I wonder if I actually can take any of this land. I wonder if this is actually, unless apart from the place I could get a claim on, it just goes, no, you've not got a claim on this. You just have to cap it. I don't really want an alliance, I'm sorry. I like. I would love to, but at the same time, you're not, you're where I want to expand. Um, What can I do over here? Marketplace? No, we can't build a marketplace. Build a fortress anywhere along here, though. Might build it here. Build a fortress there. And we have our own fortress to def defend against this, like, long, thin tube, they call it, of, like... I don't know. Just a... This, there's no defences until here. Which is a bit worrying, so I'm going to put some defences up here. But, um... Let's see, what time? Oh yes, we're in the perfect, right, we're in perfect time to go to war with the elves. So we will do so. This is, goes very much against all, uh, all the policies of man in this period, but right now I couldn't care. I just want to kill some people off, annex some lands. Also, they don't deserve to be here. I mean, I don't, don't remember these guys being here that long, if at all. Um, I'm definitely wrong, but, uh... National population growth, that's perfect. Um, but I'm definitely, yeah, I'm definitely wrong. They probably were there. I just don't want them there. Uh, Dol Amroth also is very close. It can probably help nicely in taking them out. I support my heir. You He's the general of the 5th Army as well. You definitely need to support my heir. Even though the 5th Army is probably, is actually my smallest. I couldn't care. Right. Um... God, he's taking a lot of attrition getting here. The first army's got 40 heavy infantry in it. Jeez. No wonder this guy's got so much, like, attrition. But hey, I don't care. He's going to absolutely destroy these elves. Unless these elves are really good, because I have a feeling that could be the case. Like, they have really small and early armies. Also, I have a feeling Lorien's going to hate me for doing this. I can offer to guarantee him. Yeah, sure. I'll guarantee you. There we go. Guaranteed Lorien. Then they'll probably get an alliance with them. Oh, nice. He's got a Malacris Recoverer, though. Oh, can't because he's a wrong power, which is such annoying. Yes. So my man got. My king got the, a Miraculous Recovery. Why can we not. When does this end? What? So do we just permanently have a truce? That's annoying. Um, I'll lose the popularity. I'll chide him. I don't want to flog people if necessary. Well, it looks like we can't really go to war with the elves down here now. Unless I want to take a massive stability hit. 
Um, I can't get a. Yeah, Cartland ones are constantly alliances with me. Arthur Dane would join me in a war. I don't know if I really want to do it though. I'm gonna to have to pause it very quickly for them to do it. Um, pop, do it. Uh, no, I don't really want that. There we go. Have that. I'm gonna just get this happiness up with them. Improve the relation. There we go. There we go. Now, hopefully, they like me even more. Who are these? The Shire. The Shire's got a old age. No, he's not old. He's just graying a bit. Oh no. Oh well. We're gonna have a new king. It would seem soon. Maybe. Um. Oh, two hundred. Yeah. Nah. He's pretty old now. He's. Is this is this the guy that's um let's just release him please. I don't really want my heir in prison. Um Yeah. <laughs> Didn't realise it was my heir I imprisoned, but oh well. Um I'll just take the hit. Oh no, he's been murdered. And he was a friend of mine. Um I'm just gonna put you in charge. I don't really want anyone too powerful. Um, yeah, let them fight. Yeah. I don't care if you have rivals. That's that's actually better for me if you see other people as enemies. Um, well, I... Playing as Gondor is fun. Like, it's very easy, but there's not much to expand into. Um, if you guys want me to do a different campaign as someone else, it's quite po which I'm more than happy to do. Who the he heck are these people? Merkwoodman. Ooh. But you're a woman in charge. Bjornings. Ah, oh, yes, the Bjornings, of course. Oh, he's getting sarcastic. Old age has made him sarcastic. Perfect. Um, monthly tyranny. Yep, yeah, bring that down. Um, but oh, Erebor would be quite good. They're small, but you could definitely, like, maybe go to war with... Oh, maybe not with the elves. I don't know. You could go expand westwards and then go to war with... Um, oh, the other dwarves. <laughs> There's so many dwarves over here. Um... Yeah, you could go to, certainly be interested to play as one of the other factions over here. But if you guys have enjoyed this episode anyway, I'm going to have to end it here. If you've enjoyed and want to see more, please leave a like and subscribe. Until next time, guys, bye for now.